My name is Sub Lieutenant Harry Jennings. I'm a flight observer on number six squadron. Um, being an observer, it's pretty much the, the mission commander for the aircraft. You're kind of the key link between uh, the aircraft and whatever ships uh, that are in your task group that you're working with. There's a bunch of sensors uh, on the aircraft that the observer is responsible for. So underneath the aircraft, uh, there's a large radar, uh, which acts to extend the eyes and ears of whatever ship you're working with, as so you can find uh, whatever targets are out there, uh, and then look to building a tactical picture. In addition to that, we're also using a lot of search and rescue that we can use again, like those previously mentioned sensors, to find people or ships that have got themselves into sort of strife in, in, in the water. We could also put on our utility hat uh, and play a piece in that disaster relief role using the, the aircraft winch uh, and the hook to uh, deliver much needed aid to disaster stricken countries. When I joined at 18, I, um, I was fresh out of high school and I didn't have much of an idea of what I was getting myself into. Any tips I'd suggest, uh, if your cardio is a bit poor, start getting uh, the running shoes on and um, hit the tracks. So my first deployment was a frigate deployment on HMNZS at Estimana. First port visit was um, Exercise Room Pack Hawaii and basically play a uh, series of war games for about a month. Key moments for me is when you're working in a, in a big task group uh, with a bunch of other ships and all those ships are, are looking to you to find out what other threats are out in front of them. It's quite a big responsibility. It's a fair bit of pressure, but uh, there's no pressure, no diamond. Um, so I think just having that a little bit of stress is really what kind of makes the role for me every day.